Hi, this is Dr. Ali Wei at Nose Creep Physiotherapy. I'm a registered acupuncturist and traditional Chinese medicine doctor. In my practice, I see many patients having bowel movement issues, constipation, uh, irritable bowel syndromes, or IBS. Even though oftentimes bowel movement issues is not the main concern that a patient will come in to get treatment for. Whenever I see uh, a patient have bowel movement issues, uh, while addressing their main concern, I will also address their bowel movement. Very often when patients experience the uh, improvement in their main concern, they will also in, uh, experience improvement in their bowel movement. A healthy bowel movement is very important for a body to heal, no matter what condition we're working on. Bowel movement, bowel movement is the major way our body eliminates uh, waste and toxin. And a healthy bowel movement gives our body a healthy environment for any healing to happen. Oftentimes, I see uh, patients who are constipated use uh, coffee to help them go. Coffee can help you go because uh, it stimulates the movement of the intestines. However, using coffee to help with constipation is a short-term gain and long-term suffering. Because coffee is diuretic, it drains the fluid from the intestines, making the stool drier and harder, so make them harder to go. So if uh, uh, you're experiencing constipation, um, don't use coffee to help you go, but take more fiber but not the fiber as a supplement. I mean, fiber in their natural food form. So food that are minimum process, the food that are in their natural form contains very good source of fiber. For example, if you drink orange juice, there's no fiber, but if you eat an orange, there's plenty of fiber. Another example like uh, white rice versus uh, brown rice, white flour versus um, whole wheat flour, things like that. Uh, diarrhea is another condition that uh, acupuncture can help very effectively. I had a senior patient who uh, had uh, diarrhea for two months for no reason. He would go uh, once every one to two hours, day and night which significantly uh, impact his quality of life. He went to see his family doctor and got the uh, prescription, which when he took the medication, he would go less times. However, the constipation made him feel uh, constipated. He would feel like he wanted to go, but he couldn't, which made him very uncomfortable. With acupuncture treatment, uh, he was able to stop taking the medication and his bowel movement went back to normal. For patients uh, who are experiencing diarrhea, um, if, it's, uh, if it's caused by food poisoning, you need to go to the hospital. But it's, if it's a chronic diarrhea with no specific reason, I usually would recommend my patients uh, avoid cold and raw food and drink. Only drink and eat. Uh, warm and uh, cooked food and drink. Acid reflux is another common condition I see in my practice. Acid reflux uh, or heartburn, if left untreated, uh, long-term uh, acid reflux can uh, increase the risk of uh, esophagus uh, ulceration or even cancer. And the uh, commonly used medication to treat uh, acid reflux, they uh, reduce the body's ability to absorb calcium from food. So long-term usage of antacid uh, medication increase the risk of osteoporosis and bone fracture. I have uh, I had a patient who has been suffering from acid, severe uh, acid reflux for many years. The, he dreaded the uh, going to bed at night because that's when it's worst. 
and she had to sleep using a few pillows uh, to pop her up like in half sitting position. And she has uh, used different kinds of uh, antacid medication to help her manage uh, her condition. Some medications didn't work for her. Some, even though it reduced as a reflex symptom, it gave her other uh, side effects, which make her very uncomfortable. With acupuncture treatment, she her as reflex uh, medication, uh, she didn't need to take any of those anymore. And she was able to enjoy a good night's sleep without worrying about acid reflux. When I work with patients with acid reflux, I would tell them to avoid uh, sugar and coffee. Sugar and coffee can aggravate the condition and make this condition lingering and harder to heal. Uh, the patient I just mentioned earlier she loved bubble tea. We know it's loaded with sugar. That's her favorite food. She used to have uh, one bottle of bubble tea every day. With treatment, she experienced uh, improvement in her acid reflux, but she didn't want to give up her bubble tea. So it was until she realized it's not doing any good for her and she completely stopped taking bubble tea her acid reflux heal. So if you have any uh, digestive issues and you're looking for a natural remedy, you're welcome to call our clinic 403-295-8590. I'll be happy to chat with you one-on-one -on -one about your specific condition. Thank you for watching. See you next time.